If you've got a pen and a piece of paper at home, just mark it off. Uh, so for the C1, the top 12 countries, the top 12 countries will earn quotas for next year's Olympic Games. That's the simplified version. Oh, oh. no. Here's our first competitor down. Sorry to interrupt you here. No we go. Have Noria Villarubla from Spain heading down the course. And just getting into a little bit of trouble on the first uh, on the first downward. And... Uh, Struggling to get her rhythm back now. Nuria, of course, uh, was a uh, bronze medalist here on this very course in 2015 at the World Championships. That's right. She's an amazing paddler here. She's also no stranger to qualifying Olympic quotas. Uh, I believe it was her result in 2019 that got Spain's... That got Spain the ticket uh, for, uh, yeah. for, uh, for Tokyo, of course. Uh, very, very accomplished paddler, especially... Oh, gee, that's tough, Lois. That's a tough little uh, cross there, isn't it? Yeah, for those of you who are watching the qualifications course, you're going to notice that the moves are significantly harder on this semifinals and finals course. Uh, the, the technical level has just been bumped up, not one, but two notches, probably. Mm. Uh, some of these moves are going to pose some significant challenges. And always difficult when you are the first paddler on the course. Everyone else who's paddling today, men and women, are lining the banks right now. And they're going to school on Nuria Villarubla because uh, she is showing people how to do it. And they're picking up from what she's doing, where the strong points are, where the weak points are, where you can make up time, where you can lose time. And they're all storing it away in preparation for their run. But this, it looks like it's a, hard, it's a run full of a lot of hard work at this stage, Lois. That's right. Uh, very physical, very technical. You can see, just you can see in her face the energy she's putting into this run. And uh, she's making it look easy, but not too easy, no. that's for sure. She's she's doing a very, very good job, but it, you can see how challenging this course well, is. Well, she looks exhausted. She actually looks exhausted now. She's got to the bottom. She's got a two-second penalty. So this is going to be our, our marker for the rest of the day. She's going to go across the line in a 121. Uh, doesn't look that happy, but just the one, the one.